Hello, everybody. Hi. Who's there? Who's all there? It's Roxy, and I'm here from the Face Yoga Method. How's everyone doing? I'm excited to be here today because today I'm going to be sharing my skincare tips, which I like to call Roxy's Skincare Hacks. So if you want to join me today, stay tuned. Hi everyone, I want to know how your day's going. It's Friday, can I get a whoop whoop? I want to see a whoop whoop. High curly mode, <laughs> high sweet flow. Pamela, what are you guys up to this Friday? Have you guys practiced your face yoga? I hope you have, and if not, it's all good. You can practice it while you go for a walk. If you go to the bathroom. <laughs> Anyways, Cinderella, hi. Hi, Anastasia. Hi, Samwak, Canifer, Angeliki, Scovo. Where are you guys? Where are you guys joining from? Let me know. Hi. Scovo, hi. <laughs> oh, Ali, Ali 08 RN. Hello from Mexico. Hi, Ali. Hola. Well, I'm so glad you guys are here today. I have so many treats for you today because I'm going to be sharing a few things and I hope I hope that they're helpful to you. And these are just some of the things that I do myself um, kind of like on a regular basis. And so I hope they help you. So why don't we get started? Hi, Jones. Jones Rainbow, Rain, Rainbow City. Okay, sorry, I just butchered your name. Okay, so if you guys are ready, I'm gonna talk about the first tip that I wanna share with you. And so, how many of you know what this is? Do you guys know what this is? Well, if you don't, this is a derma roller, and what this does is it's got little needles here on this rolly thing. And so what you do is you roll it on your face, and this, guys, stimulates collagen. Who doesn't want to stimulate collagen? Um, hello, smooth and firmer skin. Yes, you want to use this. Now, some people I know are scared to use it because they have heard like those horror stories I guess you could say that they're like my face is bleeding blah 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 but you know what um, these are the perfect size and really when you roll it on you don't roll it on hard you roll it on just you know softly right so anyways that's not my tip though I just wanted to tell you what it was if you didn't know which some of you know because I can see Scovo you know it boosts collagen yes <laughs> So my tip is actually, how do you clean it? Because a lot of times I get asked that question and so I wanna give you a little tip as to what I do. And I have this little bottle here and it's got a little spray thingy at the top and I put alcohol in this. And so before I use it, I spray it and then I let it air dry. I do my whole face thing and then I roll it on on a clean face and then I spray again after I'm done so that's my first thing I wanted to talk about this is that's how you clean it second thing don't use this in the morning if you're gonna roll your face with a derma roller I would recommend not to use it in the morning why because guys in the morning when you use this you don't forget that you've just um you know rolled this little thing all over your face like puncturing little holes and then you're gonna go outside in the sun your skin might not like that um and then you put sunscreen on and no just just don't do it trust me do it at night especially because at night that's when your your body heals itself. So best time to use it is at night. One last thing I want to say about this is, why do you apply after a derma roller? Some people are not quite sure, so I recommend applying 
an amazing serum that has a lot of good, I don't know, properties and benefits and this and that. So I would apply typically a vitamin C or I usually apply this. Ta -da! It's called my Oxygen Plasma and I love this thing because it's got a lot of antioxidants and it just helps heal the skin and making it nice and smooth and bright. So I use this, this is from the Face Yoga Method and it's amazing, especially after you've derma rolled because after you do that, um, your skin absorbs anything in it much better. So those are my tips for the derma roller. Now, one other thing I want to talk about, or the second thing I want to talk about, sorry. Second thing I want to talk about is, do you guys um, massage your face? I do, but sometimes, you know, I know you're all busy, you know, you work all day, you, I don't know, have things, you have things to do, you're a busy person, I get it. And then sitting in front of the mirror uh, for another, I don't know, 10 extra minutes just to massage your face, takes a long time. So I have, um, I guess you could say like a short version when I'm like, oh, I'm just too tired, like I don't wanna massage my face right now. So I'm gonna show you how I do my short version and I hope that this helps you. Okay, so let's start with, of course, posture. Posture, I would say, is probably one of the most important things in face yoga and your well-being anyways. So we always start with good posture. And the first thing I like to do is the big O because when you do the big O, it actually gives your whole face a general, um, it helps to circulate your blood, which brings oxygen to your skin which gives you that bright skin that you all want. So yes, big O is the first thing that I start, that I start with. And the big O, you do like this. You say, O. Oh. Now I want you to drop your jaw. Don't go, O. Oh. That's too hard. Just drop your jaw, say O, oh. and then your top lip, you can press it against your top teeth, and then you can open your eyes, so you go, and if you're feeling a bit more energetic, you can look up. So let's try it because that's what I'm here for. I'm here to show you what I do. So here we go. Let's do the big O and we'll hold it for five seconds just because I don't want to take up too much of your time. Mm hmm. Yes, we're going to have big O like this. Ready? Let's hold it for five seconds. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh. you can feel like ah I don't know I can feel it all over my face already like something's going on so that's a great pose to always do like at night while you're after you do your whole skin make sure you have your moisturizer on I do that's why my skin's always shiny guys because <laughs> I just put it on anyways so I like to do the big O, and then the next pose that I like to do is called the acupressure push, which we put our hands into fists, and then we glide, okay? So let's do it together, but here's the tip. I want you to breathe in, and then breathe out. And you're gonna hold up and lift up here on your temples and press in, and you're just gonna keep it there for a few seconds. So let's do this, let's do this three times. I mean, you can do it a few more times if you like, but let's just do it for three times. So remember the big O, and now we're gonna do the acupressure push. Ready? So we're all gonna breathe in, and breathe out, and bring your knuckles down, and lift up at the temples. Oh yeah, let's hold that in there for two seconds. One. Two, and just press in and let's do it again breathe in and breathe out oh 
that feels so good. And let's do it one more time, guys. Breathe in. And breathe out. And hold at the temples. Oh, you can stay here as long as you like. Oh, that feels so good. One more thing that I like to do here is I actually like to just do this. For me, I find like when I, I just, and I'm using like this part of my fingers and I'm just going in and just pressing and just, ah, uh, that just feels good. And you're relieving tension and you're also, um, what is it? Improving your circulation on your skin and you bring more oxygen and guys, this just, this just gives your skin like a healthy glow. Um, you're relieving tension. Hello. <laughs> so yeah, I just go in and I do this as well after I'm done with my acupressure push. And like I said, you can stay here as long as you want, as long as you need, but these are easy poses that you can do after you've um, washed your face and put on your, all, all your stuff. Right. And then the last thing I like to do is I like to do this is called the instant pick me up and you put your fingers on your eyebrows. Your thumbs are here at the top of your head and you just breathe in and lift up and breathe out. Oh, and then you just go like this. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. Like I feel good right now. <laughs> I hope you're doing it with me and I hope you feel good too. So let's do it one more time. And this is just relaxing, you know, and it just like lifts you up at the end. So here we go. Remember fingers on your eyebrows, fingers here, your thumbs at the top of your head, shoulders down. Don't do them up, shoulders down. And ready? We're going to lift up. Oh, that feels good to the hairline. And then we're just going to go down the side of your face. Here we're touching all the lymph drainage kind of points. So yes, the eye remove is relaxing. I find I carry a lot of tension here. So yes, Aisha, I get ya. So that's my short little, I guess you could say um, massage that I like to do because I feel like it really helps to relieve that tension and it just gives me that warmth and girl your skin's gonna look so good trust me okay last tip now that you're done right with your home massage guess what i like to do i like to add even more moisturizer here we go see this is my diy you can find it in fumiko's website at the face yoga method it's the FYI, um, do it yourself, or DIY, not FYI, sorry, DIY, do it yourself, moisturizer. And so I'm just gonna add a little bit more of that. I'm just gonna warm it up a bit. Add a little bit more to my skin because you're gonna see what I do next. And I hope you guys try this. Don't forget your neck. Always put moisturizer on your neck and on your decollete. And then the rest I just rub around my hands always. So wait for it. Here we go. I've got a hot towel, guys. <laughs> so I've got a hot towel and I just like to, oh, that feels so good. Just put it all over your face. Why? Uh, because this helps to absorb that gorgeous moisturizer that you just put on your face and it feels so good it feels so good and if you put it here oh oh goodness goodness guys i hope you try this it feels so good ah okay you can do that another one more time if you'd like you can warm up your towel again and just put it all over your face and girl, you're going to look like a queen by the end of the night. Trust me, you're going to look so damn good. You'll be like, hmm, I'm going to bed now with my gorgeous skin. So, 
okay guys i really hope you enjoyed this live i hope that my tips um help you a little bit and yeah try it try try what you'd like to try for the derma roller um if you've never done it before i would suggest you start um slowly maybe once a month and then you can keep adding more times from there um i personally do it once a week or when my when my skin needs it um i can go two weeks without doing it but sometimes my kid my skin needs it so yes very relaxing yes nico it is very relaxing i hope you try it okay beautiful face yogis thank you for joining me thank you for taking some of your time i enjoy talking about these things with you and i hope they're helpful for you and i will see you next time bye love you